Hey everybody, the Banga's back. Welcome to part 33 of Let's Play Vive for the Sega CD, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Now, finally we made the direct here, and now I'm a bit lost. So, let's just work our way around this very, very slowly. Well, at least we know there's still some of these things here. But I don't think I'll be able to kill them in time. Let's just leave that alone. Yeah, yeah, they're all gonna leave. I don't really care. Not anymore. Now I just gotta figure out, like, if going to the far right is the right idea. I wish I knew, but... You get no clues, really. I don't care. Now what I hit save, I meant to hit fast forward. Let's go already. Come on, like... Now you're just coming out of the woodwork when I don't want to fight you. Let's try this one. Um... Oh, no, no, wrong button. I'm getting thrown off, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I'm clearly... think I'm going the right way. But it just doesn't feel like I am. It's like it's repeating. Yep, yep, I'm going the wrong way. Like, this is... what the hell? None of this makes any sense. Why is there so many rooms that go to the same place? And it's all trial and error, really. And then you're just going through the same ones over and over because you're not sure anymore. I thought I found the right place, but now I don't know anymore. Oh, let's try this again. Okay, I want to stick to the far right, because if I remember looking at game facts, I saw something about the far right. Hit the wall, and there you go. No, I think it's... Oh, come on. Like, I don't even think I got a first down yet. I don't think I went 10 yards. Let's try this one. Before you had a chance to look. Okay, here we go. This one. And now we get to this part. Basically, Sabrina from Saffron City mode. And you get all these teleporters, and they go to a certain area, and you don't know what one. Oh well, let's try our luck with this thing. I don't think I'll be able to kill it, so... Yeah, I didn't think so. Okay, let's try this one. Um, let's try this one, and this one, and this one, this one, okay, I think I went the wrong way, oh, this one, ah, perfect, ah, what the hell, let's just fight one gold dragon, we can fight one, can we, can we, can we fight one? Could be a pain in the ass, but um, we can still fight one. At least once. Okay, maybe not. That was a bad idea. Do the dragon dance! Dragon dance! Dragon dance! Do everybody do the dragon dance! Do the dragon dance! Dragon dance! Dragon dance! Dragon dance! Dragon dance! Dra Thank you! Alright, finally, to get back to full health. Alright, this looks very interesting. No enemies! I guess I can just go on, look around, get some treasure. Like a guy's slow. There, this place looks a little bit peaceful, despite the epic music. Another guy's slow. It's not outside a pyramid. Let's grab whatever treasure I can find before I take on the final boss. Amanda cores, nice. What this? Oh, it's another Amanda core. Why, can you just put them all on one side or something? 
Is that too much to ask? Now, Stardust? I think that gives you a full MP or something. And a Phoenix Heart. Perfect. Alright, let's go. The moment you've all been waiting for. So, you managed to fly the aircraft, Prince. Admirable. Your ruthless scheme stops right here and now. You speak as though my great plans are submitted for your approval. You speak as if your plan has a chance of hella success. My boy, you simply don't understand. You see, my plan is foolproof. I am shaping the present civilization for a bright and happy future through science. Um, I'm thinking more like dim and crappy. Oh, that must have hurt. Mock if you must, but you'll see. But you'll soon see. I've gained enough wisdom to rule the entire throng of humanity. You forgot that I am 1,052 years old. But you are still only human. No one person has the... If you must defy me, please be more accurate. I am the supreme human. In both magic and science, I am the most powerful. It is only logical the most excellent humans should lead the lesser ones. Why does this remind me of Hitler or something? That logic is as faulty as your wicked plan. Listen. Control supported by power. Even I could never control all of humanity under normal conditions. But this armor will afford me that luxury. Do you intend to play God by using this power? Ooh, yes. I like the sound of that. I will be playing God. An absolute monarch who rules over a bright new world. But he loves you. I won't let that happen, Sadul. You don't think you can stop me, do you? So be it. One last trial before I claim my true destiny. And at my victory, a new chapter shall begin in the history of the world. You gotta be kidding. I hope this is not the boss music. This is the summit of my fortress, Draktir. It seems a proper place to decide the fate of a world. Don't you think? Okay, now the final boss battle is about to begin. Ambush! Ouch! Okay, I guess we're gonna have to start taking him out. Now, you only need to attack with Sandor, so don't bother attacking with anyone else. Use everyone else for, like, healing and whatnot. That should be the way to go. Luckily, Kinsey's uh, Odin Blade can absorb some health. Oh, jeez, that hurts. Hey, nice techno music. Oh, yeah, I can dance this shit. I think you might need to heal things up a bit, too. Ooh, jeez, that hurts. Nice. Um, I think you have to use, like, a Restore. That's much better. There, just keep it up and you'll be fine. Ah, jeez, that all hurts you a lot. Uh, okay, Newman, uh, PJ. Okay, that's not enough. How about Sarupa's Kiss? Where are they two? Up oh, there they are. Perfect. I should be using those more often. Yeah, use another Thyxol. Soon we're in low on MP. Luckily, Lynx can cast Thyxol too. So in case PJ runs low, Lynx can take over. Actually, you just might have to. Where are the moon drops? Ah, there they are. That's not a lot, only 20. Alright, so I use a back saw. And we should be fine for this turn. Oof, I hate that Mega Blast. This looks more painful than it really is. Ah, I don't want really to try spellbane. It's not worth it. 
Good thing I bought lots of Sarufa's Kisses, right? Maybe I should have bought some Hershey Kisses instead. That would be a lot better. Ouch, I know what's gonna happen. Uh, do I have anything that does like a lot of health for one person? How the hell, I'll just use a guy with glove. Actually, I was just better off using the two of this kit, but whatever. Damn, this will get the girls wet to this kind of music. Just imagine you play this at a dance club. Uh, do I have anything that gives you a lot of MP? Well, actually, I'm not gonna bother. I think I'll let PJ try a spell beam. 3 MP! A oh, BS. Okay, get the moon drops, I guess. I'm gonna use the moon drops too, on least. The worst part is when you run out of MP. That just prolongs the battle. Yeah, this is fucking groovy. I like this. You gotta admit that Ool got a pretty kick-ass sound system. At least he got that going for him. The only thing he doesn't have going for him is he got like 32,000 MP. So this battle will take you quite a while. No, wrong person. I forgot, it always starts with Sandor, rather than the person that you've been used to casting the uh, moon drops to. So you get thrown off at times, don't worry about it. Start worrying about it when you run out of healing items. Might have to use a couple Phoenix hearts in the end. Uh oh. Oh, Kinsey is incapacitated for the time being. But we'll fix up with that. Okay, here's another Thug Zone. Yeah, get some more health. Ooh, then we'll need another Rufus Kiss. There we go. Uh, let's see, I got a couple Phoenix Hearts, so I'll just use that. They are full MP for PJ. Remember, this is the last battle. You might as well use all of your healing items. It'd be a waste if you didn't. Here, use a Phoenix Heart too, Lynx. You were low on health, too. Uh-oh. Come on. Finish him off! No! Okay, one more turn, and I'm gonna stop recording. Okay, let's see if I get the finishing blow in the next video. Alright, see ya.